Do you have any just initial just advice for just, you know, being more comfortable without your clothes on? If we can sing karaoke naked, you can do anything. Yeah. We got a new, new one, Tony. You can do anything. So recently I've turned 30 and I've been doing a lot of reflecting. And I think it's about time that I become the best version of myself. Luckily for me, there's this thing called the internet, which contains, you know, a shit ton of motivational quotes. Never give up because great things take time. Sometimes you win, sometimes you learn. Confidence is silent, insecurities are loud. You got that right. Confidence is definitely not my specialty. Um, you might think just because of these videos, you know, that I'm comfortable with millions of people staring at me. I mean, the internet's one thing, but when it comes to, you know, real life, uh, I mean, I don't even like taking the subway. So on this episode, I'm gonna explore my confidence. In order to do that, I'm gonna write out a bunch of random scenarios that would uh, require a lot of confidence and uh, land on one of them. Be naked in front of a room of strangers. Consenting strangers, that is. Okay, let's go do this. So the randomizer is spoken. In order to further build my confidence, I'm gonna appear naked in front of a room full of strangers, which is definitely quite a large undertaking. So in order to further prepare myself, I'm heading to one of the largest clothing optional resorts in all of America, Deonza Springs. So uh, without further ado, let's just dive right in, take off all my clothes, and hopefully become a better man. Rocking out with my cock out, all right? Jam out with my glam. Okay. Got our first naked people on the left, but we're not gonna stop and stare. We're gonna keep it moving. All right. Thank you. How's it going? Good, yourself? I'm Taji. I'm Gary. So nice to meet you. Yep, and I'll be working with you while you're here. Oh, amazing. Should we head in for a yep. sec? Oh, this is right there. Thank you so much. This is our lounge, mainly where all the indoor activities happen. Bingo, karaoke, dance. Do you go nude? Yeah. Ever? Oh, cool. yeah. Right on. Yeah. All right. So typically most people, they come in, they check in their clothes. And once they're fully checked in, the tour is done, they run out to the car, and that's when they get undressed. By the so, car? By the car. Not in the room? Yes, definitely. Got it. All right. Let's do this. Do you guys want me to do it right here or over here? Just do it. I feel almost as if I'm in a porno right now. Okay. All right. There goes the sweatshirt. I'm a grower, not a shower. Remember that, guys. So yeah, if you want, we could probably okay. just kind of put it like kind of just right to your uh, chest. Thanks. And then here's the tricky part. I don't know what we're gonna do with this. I've been just carrying carry mine, I guess, but. Usually end up carrying something anyway. You ever had any run-ins, you know, being naked, any sort of like a branch or anything? This is the one you want to watch out for the most. If you have to brush between one of those and something else, brush against something else. Got it. That's last res not even a resort. That's right. no resort. <laughs> so I guess it's safe to say you're pretty determined when it comes to nudity. Oh yeah. I live here because I want to be nude as much as possible. In your experience of being a nudist, have you personally ever received any backlash at all? Most of my job is trying to teach people that we're not about sex, we're not about orgies. It's about just relaxing comfortably in your own skin. Sure. So yeah, the whole mission that I'm on right now is, you know, trying to, you know, find my confidence in a way. Have you ever experienced, you know, throughout your life of 
coming nude any increase in your confidence at all it does i mean it really gives you confidence that uh you can do more than you ever thought you could we were checking out your website a bunch and we saw you know all these motivational um quotes oh my god sorry almost uh almost busted my ass my bare ass that would have been good so yeah, no, we were checking out your website and we saw all these inspirational quotes. Have you seen any of those? Are you oh, I make those? them. You make, you make I them? I create everything you see online. Really? From here. That's awesome. So in terms of, you know, developing confidence through going nude, are there any kind of like tips and tricks you have? Hmm. If I can get naked, I can guarantee the situation is getting better. All right, well that was a very lovely tour and hike with Gary. Now we're gonna head over to do some nude volleyball. I'm uh, feeling quite relaxed, quite happy with everything. The breeze feels very nice. So now I guess, uh, see what happens at volleyball. Nude volleyball. As much fun as I was having, it was instantly replaced with insecurity after someone had mentioned the naked karaoke plan for the evening. So tonight we're gonna do karaoke at eight. 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 You can sing karaoke naked. You can do anything. Naked audience. <laughs> Hopefully the people of De Anza could lend me some pearls of wisdom to help me truly put my confidence to the test this evening. Once that's on though, we'll be good. I'm on this mission trying to become as confident as possible. How is being naked attributed to your confidence level? I was always comfortable with being nude, but um, once you kind of try it and live the lifestyle and you realize this is how we were meant to be as human beings. You just get more comfortable as you see other people uh, that are nude and it just it doesn't mean anything anymore. This has pretty much brought me out of my shell. Being a larger size lady, it's, it's helped me um, come to terms with like, I'm okay in my own skin. Our bodies are not something that we should be naturally ashamed of. We brought that on ourselves. Before I head out on my journey, do you guys just have like one simple, you know, uh, one simple thing, uh, one word, uh, a few words of wisdom before I head out there? When you're naked, just don't even think about it. Don't pretend. You don't have to put on anything. You don't have to act a certain way. Just be yourself. Don't be embarrassed about your body or anything else, because nobody cares. <laughs> awesome. Being in such an accepting environment like this was giving me the confidence that I never even knew I had. And the naked karaoke tonight didn't seem so scary after all. So now it was time to do what confident people do best, shoot airsoft guns while naked. How's hey. it going? Good. I'm Taji. Same here. And so, this be newbie. So nice to meet you. This is newbie right here. That's newbie. Is he nudist friendly? Oh yeah. I'm assuming. Oh, yes. All right. What do you suggest uh, I shoot? I yeah. guess as like a beginner. No one's a beginner. Awesome. You hit it. Awesome. What's your experience been like living here all year round? It's a very good community. It's just uh, somebody gets sick or has a problem, there's always somebody to come in to help take care of them. And it's very peaceful. Yeah. Do you have any words of wisdom to kind of share with me as I embark on this journey? <laughs> just don't worry about it. You can't even think of being naked. But you realize no one really gives a damn what you look like. <laughs> Which is, is a good thing. Thank you, Sonny. Let's see if I can make this one on those words of wisdom. Right. Oh, Awesome. As the sun was setting on De Anza Springs, the hour of my naked karaoke debut was getting closer. And although I felt very reassured, I was still certainly nervous. I tried to get my mind off my nerves by doing some of my favorite hobbies, but that wasn't working at all. 
So I scoured the premises, seeking some final words of wisdom. So I'm heading on pretty soon to do some karaoke. Mm -hmm. I haven't, you know, sang really for anyone before. You know, just imagine your audience naked. Thank you for the words of wisdom. Certainly. Thank it's great to so have you much. here. It's been so fun. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks again. All right. The moment was finally here. My name was on the board, and my new friends were singing their hearts out. As I stood there, moments away from my true test of confidence, I reflected on the motivational advice I had collected thus far. You can do more than you ever thought you could. Just don't worry about this it. This is how we were meant to be as human beings. Just imagine your audience naked. You just have to enjoy just it. Be yourself. Be yourself. Be yourself. I have somebody else's spine in my back. They took a spine out of a cadaver and they put it in me. I did it, and the results were in. That was awesome. Thank was you awesome. so much. You're so kind to tell me that. Thank you. You did good, though. Thank you. As I exited those doors and entered the night, I felt unstoppable. And the next day, charged with confidence. Hey, Gary. How you doing? Good, you? Yep. Pretty good. So, what do you think? It wasn't as crazy as I thought it was going to be, you know, once I was fully naked walking around, I I mean, I felt free, I felt more comfortable. Good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy about that. It means uh, we did our job, and I thoroughly enjoyed working with you. I'm so glad you had a good time. I'm so glad everyone's happy in the end. Feel one step closer to hopefully becoming a better man. Don't